evening. Got the dogs loaded up already. We're gonna start rigging and uh, yeah, try to find a bear. That's always the goal. But uh, our early hunting season went out a couple weeks ago. We killed a few bear, but now we're back to just chasing them for a couple months till December. Then we can, then we have another kill season that comes in. But yeah, today's goal is just to find a bear and get it treed. What well, I'm gonna try to be better at is explaining what's going on during the hunt. So right now we're rigging. So pretty much just looking for the bear, uh, trying to find the right spots where the bear would be at or had been at. You know, a lot of factors come into play when trying to find a bear, what time of year it is, what time of day it is, the way the wind's blowing, uh, a lot of different things. But right now, just trying to find one. And once we, we find one, usually the chase is on. I forgot to mention that Eric was hunting with me today. We've been split up just trying to cover more ground, uh, trying to find a bear. But uh, he said he rigged one and turned the dogs loose and they start opening on the ground, so I believe the chase is on. So now I'm just trying to get up there to him and I get my dogs turned into the chase. Well, the dogs are already showing tree. Uh, got turned in and they didn't run another 10 minutes. So showing pretty close to the road so it shouldn't be a bad walk well they got a tree it's chase claw and kimber We're loaded back up and on the move again. I'll see if we can find another bear. Uh, dogs did good on that chase. But hopefully we can find another one so these, these other dogs can get some exercise. Definitely got one going. That was a hot strike. Um, Eric's about to turn his dogs into the chase. So, gonna get packed up and put some heat on this bear. Well, we got a split chase, rain and claw split from my other four, which is Chase and Tate, Tess and Coley. Um, they split and Eric got his three turned into rain and claw. So, we got two chases going right now. Uh, trying to keep up with both of them. Let's see if they can get these things caught. Rain and Cooper and Libby, Claw and Kimber, they're still running. But uh, my other four, Tate, Coley, Tess, and Chase, uh, they were packed up and I'm getting bark monitors on them. So I say they're right there with the bear or they got a treat now. So I'm gonna get in here and see what they got.
All right, guys. Y'all can probably hear them dogs. They're walking with this bear. It doesn't want a tree, so they're just staying right with it, putting pressure on it, but it doesn't want to climb. So I want to figure out a way to get these dogs off this bear. I don't know if y'all can see the bear or not, but it decided to climb, so that's good. Now I just gotta get up here and get the dogs tied up. And... Good dogs, good dogs, good girl. Good dogs, good dogs. Good dogs. Hey, bear. Good dogs. Come on, take. Got the dogs off the tree. Uh, headed back to the buggy now. Uh, Dogs did a good job on that one. I didn't think it was going to climb, but I was wrong. So now I'm going to go to the buggy and try to catch up to them other dogs. Uh, last I had track on them, I think they were showing treats. So Eric might be already to them. I'll see when I get back to the buggy. got back to the buggy and uh, Eric had told me that them dogs had a bear tree too. So, Rain and Claw, Cooper, Liberty, and Kimber had another one themselves. So, one strike and we got two bears off of it. So, pretty good evening. Three bears and it's seven o'clock now. So, gonna head home and call it a night. I appreciate y'all for watching.